Meet Cass, the disaster-seeking misfit of her school. Her two grandfathers give her a mysterious box found in a dead magician's house. It contains the Symphony of Smells, an antique kit used to create music and messages through scent. Cass meets her awkward schoolmate Max Ernest, who talks too much because his divorced parents still live in the same, but different, house. Cass and Max Ernest decide to team up with each other and investigate the dead magician's house to try to unlock the secrets of the Symphony of Smells. In the dead magician's underground study, they uncover a secret journal, but are soon discovered by the mysterious Dr. L and Ms. Mauvais. Cass and Max Ernest decode the secret to the magician's story in his notebook and realize that something sinister is behind the two handsome Dr. L and the two beautiful Ms. Mauvais. Like they kidnapped an odd boy named Benjamin Blake from school and took him to a secret youth rejuvenating spa. Cass goes undercover and becomes a guest of the spa in order to save Benjamin Blake, only she doesn't know that Dr. L and Ms. Mauvais already know who she really is. But Max Ernest knows that Cass is in trouble and is determined to rescue her from the evil spa. Is there a secret to eternal youth in the magician's coded notebook? Are Dr. L and Ms. Mauvais more than what they appear to be? Will Cass and Max Ernest and Benjamin Blake figure out the secrets and escape from the horrors of the Midnight Sun Spa? I don't know! Well, I do, cause I read the book, but I can't tell you. But I can tell you that this exciting story is funny, clever, and has one of those authors that talks to the reader. It's some type of narrator. I forget. Anyways, this book has mysterious objects, suspenseful situations, creepy grown-ups, and... Oh, right. The name of this book is Secret, and it's by Pseudonymous Bausch, published by Little Brown and Company in 2007.